Hello everyone, in today's video I'll be showing you how to withdraw this your free tokens from the Velox network. Okay, I'm gonna be showing you how I withdraw this, I withdraw my tokens to my trust wallet. Alright, now I want you to understand that here in this Velox network, as soon as you are done mining and you've accumulated up to 10 USDT, what you can do is to swap the free tokens from the wallet um, to USDT. All right, it's only when you can, it's only, you, the token can only be swapped to USDT and withdrawn to any wallet, all right? So what you'll be doing is that for you to be able to withdraw these um, tokens, uh, mind you, for those of you that don't have idea about what this project is all about, I made a video on how to navigate the project and how to mine it. You can check the video at the video description, all right? So in this video, I'll be going straight on how to withdraw your tokens and cash out immediately. All right. So if you are new in this channel, I want you to hit the subscribe button and turn on your notifications so that whenever I'm dropping um, the video video regarding the um, listing of this project to other exchange exchanges, you will be notified and other future updates. And also do your best to join the WhatsApp and Telegram group to stay more updated. Without further ado, let's get started. So for you to be able to withdraw your free tokens, free Velox tokens, you have to come over to navigate to where you have this, this wallet right here, okay? You tap on it. As soon as you tap on it, it will take you to this section, all right? Now, you are going to be swapping this token to, to Velox network. The reason being that this Velox network hasn't been listed in other exchanges, but it's currently traded in here in this wallet at this current price all right so whatsoever you've accumulated can be swapped to usdt at this current price i hope that is clear enough so now for you to be able to swap these tokens you have to click on where you have this swap right here okay you click on it and then you select the maximum amount maximum or minimum amount you want to be swapping to so here i want to be swapping um my velox network to um to 386 and then you can see the minimum the um equivalent of what you are swapping at and here is what one vlx is currently trading at okay so i'll just go ahead and tap on swap and then i'll be swapping the tokens all right you can see converted successfully good now you can see that the token has been moved has been converted successfully to the velos network as soon as you do that all right so you can see here that when you come over here now you can see that it is showing zero right here it is showing 0.00 vlx this is because i have swapped the token to um to um the usdt okay i have swapped the token to usdt so i'll just come over here now and and see that the token has been converted successfully to usdt this is what the token has been converted to all right so now i'll now head over to trust wallet and go and paste a copy um my usdt address and come back to this wallet and paste it right here okay so for you to able to do that you have to come to where you have this this video right here you come over to where you have this withdrawal you are going to be pasting the wallet address from trust wallet um right here okay you can now turn over you can you can go over to your trust wallet copy the address first of all you have to tap that section you have to tap that place and come here and select the network that you want to be sending to all right the network that you want to be set, you want to be copying your um like the usdt network that you want to be these tokens to be swapped to and sent to your trust wallet so you go to your trust wallet and go and copy the particular network and come back to this app and paste that um the wallet address of that network you've copied right here i hope that is clear enough so right now i want to be selecting beb 20 because beb 20 which is the binance smart chain network has the lower fees so that is the network i'm gonna be copying copying so i'll just tap here and change change it to bep 20 okay 
I'll change it to BEP20. You can see here that BEP20 is showing, all right? You can see BEP20 is showing, okay? So I'll now minimize and go to my Binance, go and open my Trust Wallet and copy the BEP20, USDT BEP20, okay? So here is my trust wallet. I'll just head over to where you have. Um, if you can't find, in case you scroll down here and you can't find USDT, what you have to do is to head over to where you have this search bar at the top right corner. Okay, you head over to where you have this search bar at the top right corner. You type USDT. All right, you type USDT. You are going to be seeing different kinds of USDT right here. Okay, but in case you don't see the the bmb or the binance matching usdt what you have to go to do is to go and copy the contract address and come back here and paste it okay so in order for us to um locate where the contract address is you we are going to be making use of the um coin market cap all right we are going to be copying the address all the way from coin market cap because why we are copying the address is because we can locate the particular BEP20 um, BEP20 that we are looking for right there on on um, right there on Trust Wallet, okay? So we want to make the work easier for us. So we just head over to Coin Market Cap and go and copy um, the BEP20 USDT, okay? So here is my Coin Market Cap. You can download the app if you don't have it. It's on Play Store or Apple Store, okay? So here is my Coin Market Cap. I'll just head over to um where I'll just hold over to this section right here and type USDT, okay? I'll type USDT. All right. So as soon as you type USDT, you can see it's the first one that has just loaded out. So I'll click on it. I'll tap on it and let it load. As soon as it's done loading, you have to come to where you have this section right here. Where you have this, you are going to be moving this to the left so that I can you move it to the left, okay? Move it, move it, move it, move it down to the left so that you can see this is what we are looking for so we tap on this about right here okay so as soon as you type on about you come to where you have this contract address you come to where you have this contract you tap on it then as soon as you tap on it you can see here that this is the available um network on these are all the available network on usdt all right so i'll just head over to this bnb right here tap on it and copy it okay i have successfully copied it now we'll move back to trust wallet and go and look for and go and paste it so that we can be able to copy that particular u 20 usdt that we are looking for okay go over to this search bar right here and paste that address we've copied right here in this search bar you can see that usdt had just popped out okay so we we'll tap on it all right so as soon as we tap on it it's going to load up this go over to where you have this um go back to where you have this receive just here in the bottom you where you have this receive you tap on it as soon as you tap on it you copy your address okay you tap on it and copy that address all right and then head back to the app head back to the velux network and complete the process all right so now we'll head back right here and paste that address we've copied right here okay so paste that address we've copied right here and then we'll come here and insert the amount that want to be moving okay like i've swapped two usdt so i want to be moving um that is the maximum i want to be sending to my um trust wallet okay so i'll now tap this withdraw right here and paste as soon as i click withdraw it is gonna load and 
you can see that it's not up to 10 usdt that is why it can't transfer but as soon as you accumulate 10 usdt then you can go ahead and place your withdrawal and as soon as you click on this um transfer right here it's gonna be sent to immediately to your trust wallet and then you can cash out immediately all right you can see the the usdt is gonna be reflecting straight up in your trust wallet okay that is how to go about it that is how to go about this process if you have any question drop them at the comment section and if you enjoyed this video do your best to hit the subscribe button and turn on your notifications so that i can stay updated and whenever i post a new video see you in the next video Thank you.